Spider-Man, Spider-Man, friendly neighborhood Spider-Man. Can he swing from a web? No, he can't. He's a man. Look out. Let's play the Spider-Man. So now we're going to the next level. The construction zone. So there are these gargoyles. That you can, uh... Okay. Kick open. And there are these manhole covers. You can also open. So these guys, there was one of them in the first level, but I forgot to mention this. In, in the same beta that showed the vermin, these guys were other vault guards that were like that same size so it was supposed to be a dude in an armor not just a dude in a weird shirt that doesn't cover his torso with a weird glowy hand they were dudes in armors with weird glowy hands who were vault guards and had spikes all over them but it was one of the things that was cut because I guess because you know this is a kids game so there are three mantle covers here and uh, two of them are explosions. Exploding manhole covers. Nope, now this does nothing. Uh, so this building, there are three ways to get up. This one, also an explosion. This one takes you down. Uh, these holes? You know, you think you fall in there, you die? Nope! They just infinitely explode. Like... Why? Why couldn't, you know? Uh. Hey. Hey, guy. And, uh, unfortunately, this is another entrance to the sewer. So, we're back here again. Hey. Hi, guy. How's it going? This time, uh, we'll just beat Lizard once. I like to back away. Okay, we're good. Yeah, so every level has, except I think the uh, the Brooklyn Bridge, which is a weird short level, uh, has an entrance to the sewers. Oh, and not the 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 last level also doesn't the vault, but uh. So you come here like four times over the course of a, a regular playthrough, and it's worth it because you get so much, so many lives. Unless you're, although it's sort of a catch-22 because if you're, if you're bad enough to need the lives, you're also probably gonna die a lot down here. Catch, catch-22 or whatnot. But. Yeah, platforming in this game can be weird. Like, just the, this is just the random platform you can jump on. The, this game does not, uh, yeah, you have to sort of go left the whole time. It's weird. Only after playing the game a lot and uh, kind of studying it in a way to figure out how to do stuff consistently do I know how to do a lot of the, a lot of this, this stuff. So, uh, shoot. There's another life up there, and I want it. Oh, no. So that's another, actually, lesson in how hitting your head in this game can be really bad. That's an explosion. It's full. And this is life, and that's an explosion. Hydro Man again. Because I guess he just dissolved in the sewer water after we beat him before. 
that last Fantastic Four token and get this grenade, you know, for no reason. And then we do this part again. And, uh, let's see if I could be less bad at it this time. So I don't remember... Should have maybe looked that up a bit more, but I kind of don't care. Ugh. Yeah. So. Ugh. What am I doing? You just sort of have to jump around to not get hit by him. And uh, we're done here. I think. I don't think there's a way I can climb. No, that that wall's not climbable. All those jumps. Too high. And now we're back. To get shot in the back. Again, explosions. But, uh, whatever. So now we get to show... Now, this is the first way you get up, is just take a fucking elevator. Secret. Underground. That's the only reason this building exists. Elevator. But, uh... Before we fight Shocker, let's show off, uh... You know, the other ways to get up here. Which is to go... This, it won't let us in for some reason. So, back here, if you see these little... Like, that edge there, these are platforms. Ugh. And if I can... If I can do it right... This can be this this one jump is tricky and you can't really see what you're doing. But I'm trying to jump over there. There we go. So now I climb up, pop out, climb up. Climb up, pop out, jump. There's another one where I can stand there. And uh, now I'm back up here. Oh, but uh, I don't want to fight you yet, Shocker. So let's, let's look, let's explore a bit. I missed that gargoyle. Um, I missed that gargoyle. <laughs> that one's an explosion for some reason. Nice. That's full health. Oh, and now we're back at the bottom. So that way, so, both those ways take a little while, and they have their ups and downs, but you can also, you know, just climb up. Like, at some point, what's what's the point of those more complicated pads if you can just do that, you know? Oh, getting over there is actually going to be kind of a pain. Alright, now let's fight Shocker. Oh. He's not that hard. 
So now, you have to web swing on this girder. Again, how do you know that? Because eventually you figure it out. Like, and there's the Daily Bugle in the background. So this is a thing on Spectacular that is one of the big reasons I don't speedrun this game on Spectacular. Is that fucking barrel there? It's just... It just pisses me off. Uh, can I get... Okay. Alright. So there's that barrel there, and now... We can get this. Which is full health. Hooray. Uh... So yeah, this is all design that doesn't matter. It's just fu weird. I like the options. It was a neat place to, like, explore. But it's so weird, they put so much in here. Like this. Why? Why did you put a secret hole here that takes you all the way back down? That you can't climb back up. You can only get that... that high. I don't... Especially if it's... I don't... Mm, why? It's a big question with this game. A lot about this game is why. Barrel. So you can walk, uh, and here's the first time you fight the owl. The owl shows up a lot in this game. Everyone just, everyone who, uh, like, is less knowledgeable than me, or in, just in general, doesn't know who that is. I just people see call him Wolverine all the time because of the claws. It's Owl. He was in an episode of the one episode of the cartoon. He's like a gangster boss. Uh, there's the shield helica helicarry in the back, and the uh, Baxter building. Although that's, you know, not where the Baxter building is. Baxter building is way farther uptown, like more near Midtown. Kind of weird thing. Also, he this is the real first time you're supposed to fight the Spider Slayer. Again, you see, I just hit that explosion, and just nothing. Because I got out of there fast enough. I got the Statue of Liberty in the background. It's all... It's all very nice Brooklyn skyline. Because we're in Brooklyn right now. Brooklyn. That'll come up again later. So now we've got this level. Oh yeah, we've got these dudes. I don't get to fight these dudes much, because they're only on the uh, harder difficulty. And he exploded. So this is one of the first, like... So again, like that last stage, this is a vertical stage. I, enemies can shoot e each other, which is neat. I always like games where that that's possible. Uh, also, this has a bunch of other bullshit in it. Like that. Yeah, so this is another jumping into the background where you have to you know, jump to get in and out of there. Also, you can go this way and be less likely to fall down that hole. And that's that's a little spider slayer doggy. So there's Hammerhead. Now, here's the thing about Hammerhead. He can't hit you when you duck. Normal enemies in this game can hit you when you duck. Hammerhead? Nope. I just got hit there because I screwed up and let go of duck. So now you can't get through here. You have to be able to uh, to know about doing this. No, Nothing back there. So I love this box. So notice how I just slipped off there? That was not from touching the button. These boxes are, like, real slippery. And I feel like that web there is to, like... I don't... It's like someone noticed. Like, someone put a sticky note there saying, Hey, these boxes are kind of fucked up. 
You just sort of like fall off them, but and they just left it there. Like what? 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 That's such bad platform thing. Like jeez, man. There's a scorpion spider slayer, although it's super tiny. And it faces you and explodes. So I could. You can jump off to the left and go all the way back. I didn't expect that that thing to jump down like that. So more little traps. That one gives you stuff. This one is actually the way you have to go. Oof! About to get spider armor over here. Uh, I gotta keep going up. There's a pit there, but notice how that one is at least like marked by the. It's marked by that crane in the back. So there's the Black Widow Slayers. You only see these on uh, the harder difficulty. They don't explode for whatever reason. So the seahorse there is marking that. Uh, full health. So now there's Owl again. You know. Just. Because why not? Why not just fight the Owl over and over? Uh. I despawned him. Because he got too far off screen. Okay. So here. Uh, let me take care of this. I forgot about this thing. Uh! All the way back down. Oh no! So, this is the kind of stuff that, like, when you're a kid, or when you're playing playing this game for the first time, drives you up the wall. So here, we have to climb up, and we have to, uh, but what happens? You get here? Can you web? Nope. Nothing. You have to hit that switch. And then this moves. And if you miss getting on here when it starts moving, you have to wait for it to go all the way here and come all the way back. Which is kind of a long time. So now we've got the Spider Slayer. And I'm actually just going to... So, the only reason I can stand in him like this is because I have the spider armor. If you don't have the spider armor, you just get pushed off, and then there's an extra life over there that I'm going to grab. Spider-Man, Spider-Man, radioactive Spider-Man, spider blood, spider blood, radioactive spider blood. Spider-Man, 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 Spider-Man.